What's up everybody, welcome back to a new video. And this is actually a familiar product as you see in front of me. This is the Championship Collection Basketball Box, I guess 2019, um, by the MJ Holding Company. And you're probably saying, um, why are we doing this again? And that's a great question. Uh, last time we weren't too thrilled, were we? Well, things have changed since the last time we did that. Uh, let me give you a little brief background history. So. The company that makes these boxes, they, you know, they buy a bunch of packs, you know, ahead of time, a bunch of stuff, and then they, you know, want to make pretty uniform boxes. So say, like, each one has, will probably have the same three fat packs and the same, like, packs inside here. Even though they show pictures of, like, Luka Doncic one of ones and all that stuff, you're most likely not getting that. You know, they buy their jersey cards and they buy their packs, and they're pretty standard throughout all the ones you'll get. So I bought the ones of these from last year, and they had 20, 13, 14 prism packs in them, basketball. So... I mean, that's significant because that's Giannis' rookie year, and those packs are like $50 on eBay. They're a hobby, too. Um, pretty much, they loaded these up and made them, sent them out, and that was when it blew up. Of course, that was the year Giannis won MVP. That was last year. Uh, this year, they included Optic packs in these. Now, Optic has since blown up. Now, while these are not $50 packs um, yet, who knows? They could be. Uh, the... LeBron, Luca, Trey, all the hollows in here have exploded, and as well as the prices for this stuff too. So getting optic packs is huge uh, for this company. I feel bad for them because every time they buy these, you know, all this wax, they always choose the one that just skyrockets in value. So I mean, yeah, they're probably happy that these are going flying off shelves, but they're probably like, dang, like we could have gotten so much more in value for these for these packs, optic, prism, this optic too. So we'll see what we can get. I'm hoping for optic packs. Obviously, we're far from guaranteed to get LeBron, Luca, or Trey Hollow, but I just thought it'd be nice to uh, rip some more of these and revisit it, see if maybe these three are different from that one we ripped. So we did just rip one last time. So I have my handy dandy blade. We will crack these open. Let me move this little peanut I used to prop it up. And see, now it looks like kind of, it's too in your face now. That's why I always kind of have it propped up. So it's a little more light on it. Not a huge difference, but it's nice. Uh, speaking of optic, we have Jaren and we have Aiton in the back. I do have some Luka and Trey action, but nothing crazy except one Luka. Um, but yeah, we get two Mem cards, three Fat Packs, six Factory Sealed Packs. Look for randomly inserted rookie cards of today's top stars. I mean, we're ripping four in total now, so we should at least get one of those. I wouldn't mind seeing a Luka Holo. <laughs> but yeah, that'd be very rare. And there's the Championship Collection. From now on, whenever I see this, I'm just going to buy it. That being said, I have seen no shortage of these products that are not worth it. So last year's was, but in the past, they haven't always been home runs. So I wouldn't just like jump the gun every time you see it. I mean this year, but for example, next year, it could be, you know, back to what we don't like. If I can get this open. All right. Let's see what we can get. If we can get this open. All right, there we go. Very interested to see what packs we get. Watch us get no optic packs now. We get all those, uh, Jordan packs, whatever it was. All right, moment of truth. Aha, I see some optic. So we have our fat packs. So it looks like we actually did change it up a little bit this time. All right, we have, oh, that's not bad. 18, 19 basketball, uh, Don Russ, and then two 15, 16. And then let's see. All right, we got what counts. The two optic packs. We did get these two, and that's where those are the big packs. Uh, we did not get any of the. Um, we got hoops from. What year is this? Twelve, thirteen. So actually, that's not a bad year to get them. And then we have a. Uh, what Ray Allen? Not bad. That's actually not bad at all. And who's this? Jamal something. All right, cool. But Ray Allen, I'll take that. But um, we did not get the 17-18 optic pack we got last time. So this one actually varies in packs a little differently than last time. We have some Fleer, Fleer, and Fleer from 94-95. So I don't really know much about this. You guys are going to have to help me out big time. Um, we'll end with optic. So like this. And these are... Let's see what kind of packs these are. This is the most important one. So these are from... Yeah, base hollow. That's the one you're looking for. Then there's hyper pink checkerboard. So these are from one of the mega boxes. Base rated rookies hollow, pink checkerboard. I forgot which ones this is. This is, but there's two different types of mega boxes, and uh, this is from one of them. So right off the bat, we do have a solid hit. I mean, that's not a bad hit for one of these. 
Uh, these three FLIR packs, for those of you guys who asked me to open older stuff, here you go. I know nothing about this, so this is going to be brutal. And this will be a longer break because we have three of these boxes. But, you know, just got to run through it so we can rip those optic packs. Oof, man, dude, these are brutal. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> This is crazy, man. Like, these are straight up stuck together. I wish they wouldn't include these. Like, I almost can't. I'm gonna. I feel like I'm gonna just rip these cards apart before they come apart. Alright, um, so I don't even know half these guys. You gotta go to help me out. Uh, I still haven't recognized any of these guys too much. And half these cards have another card stuck behind them. All right, Antonio Davis, I recognize. Look at these things are stuck. Dennis Rodman. So I don't think you'll find much value in these packs. But yeah, I'm mainly just trying to peel these all apart. If you see anything worth money, or like worth, not even worth money, but just like worth uh, noting, do mention it out of these packs because I certainly don't know. I can't even get these two apart. There you go. Uh, Chris Webber. So that's not a bad one. I like Chris Webber. Put it here for now. Man, this is so look at yeah, look at this. I mean like barely get these apart. Antonio Davis. These are all facing different the wrong way now. <laughs> so I flipped it. And it's like peeling a sticker off, really. Greg Anthony. His uh son Cole Anthony, I believe, is gonna go behind the draft. Sean Bradley. Stacey King. Ooh. Man. That sound, even though I know these like aren't really worth anything, it still hurts um, to like hear cards make that noise. Man, that was that, these are rough. I really hope that like there aren't any more of these after this one because these are hard to open, hard to take apart, and from my understanding, not worth anything. Oof. Oh my gosh, this is hard. This is straight up like a brick. Look how much pressure I'm putting. This won't even like separate. Oh, dude. <laughs> I mean, I almost can't get these apart in ti a timely manner. We may just have to, like... Yeah, these are these are just, like, trash. Like, look how these are so stuck together, they're just destroying themselves. Because these are straight up, like... You can't even get these apart. I'm hoping there's nothing worth it, anything in here, but I'm probably just going to, like, not even separate these. If, yeah, I can't even get these apart. I mean... We have a Scotty Pippen card here. Let me see if I can get that to separate. No, I can't, man. It sounds like I'm cracking ice. Do you hear that? Scotty Pippen, that one only got a little bit destroyed. You can't even get these apart, man. Yeah, so, uh, Jeff Hornacek, Doug Christie. I mean, I don't really care about these cards too much. These ones, I, I'm just gonna quickly Ooh, man, this is rough. Yeah, I mean, there you go. Last pack of this. Oh, this, I mean, this stinks. I would almost rather not have this pack than have them. The fact that you got three of them, you kind of know that, like, they're not really worth anything. Ooh. Yeah. I mean. Jeez. Ooh, that sound. All right. Um, Dan Marley and uh, Tim Hardaway there, Kevin Duckworth. This is almost like I, I'm almost gonna encourage you to just kind of like uh, skip through these packs as I'm opening them. I know some people want to kind of see this, but like if, if you're not interested in this, and I, I assume most of you aren't, just skip till we get to this pack. Like that, that's actually gonna be a, a break. This stuff going through the time to even take this apart is not worth it. Okay, you know what? Enough of that. Please, 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 Lord, please don't have any more of those packs. That was so brutal. And it actually hurts your hand. You gotta keep in mind, these cards are pointy and they're like rigid on the edges. So you're trying to put so much pressure on these, it almost hurts your hand. We have a filler in these. I don't know why they put fillers in these. Oh, well, these ones are stuck too. But these shouldn't be as stuck together. Okay, there you go. Taj Gibson, Enos Cantor, Lamb. Bass, Conley. I feel like we have a lot of time to make up for. We just spent like 
I mean, a whole year on that that junk stack. Elite Series Shaq, that's actually a nice looking card. Um, Passing Kings Westbrook, Raider Rookie Hazonia, Raider Rookie Huertas, Willie Colley Stein, and Kevon Looney. I don't know why I didn't come up with come out with an optic this year for, uh, for 15, 16. It was a good, I mean, it wasn't an amazing class. It was just a solid class. You know, Towns, D'Angelo Russell, Porzingis, uh, Devin Booker. Huh, what are the odds we get two with fillers in them? I've never even seen too many fillers in fat packs. All right, base, 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 and base. Elite Series LeBron. We have a Passing Kings, Russell Westbrook. Uh, Aaron Harrison, Trey Lyles. We have Stanley Johnson and Bobby Portis. He's actually a, good, a solid pack. That's not that. This one's not that bad at all. Getting some uh, Don Russ for eighteen nineteen. I mean, there's no next day autographs in here, like hobby. But at least I don't think there are. I mean, maybe you can pause it and take a look for me. But I definitely want to finish this in time. So if we can get a you know Luca or a Trey Raider rookie out of here. I would consider this a huge success. All right, let's see what we get. I don't even want to flip these cards. See, I know it'd flip back eventually. LeBron. Hopefully, that's foreshadowing to a hollow will pull. Here we go. We have Lock It Up, Big Cat, blocking a Grizzly. Not a fan of that card. Rookie Kings, Musa, Wiggins. Here's our Costas, Dante, Knox. Hutchinson, MPJ. Of course, if I don't know what happened, why are these always so flipped? Uh, Keurigs and Musa. I don't think there's any numbered cards in there or anything. Yeah, all right. Now to the second to last one before we get to that one. And man, this break's going to be way long. Man. Okay. Uh, Lester Hudson, Tyrone Corbin, coaches. I don't like coach cards. That much Patrick Patterson board members Tyson Chandler not even a rookie Terrell Harris all right and then there there you go I don't even know that oh that expired eons ago so we're not gonna even that's not even gonna see oh, now we're gonna see the light of day right, we want to see some hollow action here these optic packs. Kemba Walker. Uh, we don't have a hollow, but we have Jalen Brown and a uh, winner stays. JJ Brea. PG. And we still have two more of these. Oof. Come on, hollow. Oh, we have a hollow. Avery Bradley. Zach Randolph. Jalen Brown. Still hollow. Oh, man. I just want so badly to pull that Braun or Luca. Portray. And my camera keeps on focusing because it likes making the break hard. And Mitchell Robinson. All right, that's one down. Uh, I think I completely underestimated how long this will take. But let's quickly get into the second one. I'm not gonna. I'm not rushing like the ones I like. But those Fleer packs, I might just like open up, rip apart, and then move on because those aren't worth it. Now, if you are watching this and you know that there's something nice in this pack, for example. Let me know, and I'll go, you know, search through that mess, because it's a mess. It's nothing short of a huge mess. And also, where are those randomly entered rookie cards they were talking about? We have, that's a good sign, another Donmus. We have another one of these. Another one of these. And there was one card just sitting all the way at the top there, I can feel. And oof. Oof in the chat, man. We have some more of those packs. Uh, jersey cards, Amari Stoudemire, so we're actually getting some solid jersey cards, so props to them for adding some better jerseys, and a Jason Richardson, all from the same set, and Upper Deck 2008-9, okay, and three of these flare packs, dude, like, I don't even know if I'm gonna open these flare packs, I'm just gonna leave these here for now, maybe rip them at the end, because those are trouble, those are troublemakers, and we don't want to see them anymore, let's open up these fat packs, and rip some real cards, See, this is the card I felt that was kind of a lot of base cards here. I think these are all just base. There we go. 
We have a Tim Duncan Elite Series. And let me guess, Russell Westbrook? Oh, no. Passing Kings. Oh, it was a Passing Kings. Uh, John Wall there. Chris McCullough. Sam Decker. We haven't gotten any of the top rookies yet. Uh, Kelly Oubre Jr. and Miles Turner aren't bad. All right. Other pack of this. Not a bad fat pack to get, not going to lie. The only, you know, rated rookie or the rookies cards you can get for this class, really. Flip through our base. Uh, extra edition Chris Bosch. Rebound Kings. A lot of Kings in this. Kim Lajuan. Bobby Portis. Rakeem Christmas. Okafor. That's a, one of the top rookies. RJ Hunter. Not a top rookie anymore, but once upon a time. He was one of the guys. Now a solid player. All right. Flip through this, and we'll really hope we can get one of those uh, Lucas. It's not the optic ones, but it's still worth. Ooh, we have a shiny, shiny, shiny. Oh, oh, we got a number card. We have a franchise future of Aaron Gordon to ninety nine. That's nice. And James Harden. So I guess you can find the rookies ones in here too. So that'd be pretty cool. So these packs are definitely good ones to get. I'm happy that they included these. Those are not numbered, but they're nice parallels. James Harden there. All right, let's see who our rookies are. Brunson, Bridges, Sexton, Evans, Wendell Carter Jr., and it randomly flips. Wagner, Diallo, and um, D'Angelo Russell. All right, 2008-9 upper deck. Really don't know what I'm looking for in here, so once again, I need my 2008-9 upper deck guys. This one's on you. Need your help. Kenyon Martin, Shane Battier, uh, Jordan Farmer, Gilbert Arenas, Greg Oden. This is his second year, yeah, okay. Then we have Ron Artest, Dynasty, BJ Armstrong, all these corners are just destroyed, and uh, StarQuest. All right, optic time, come on, come on, come on. Let's get some fire. Lou Williams, Buddy Healed, no fire in here. Giannis, Franchise Futures. All right, after this we have one more. That, I don't think we have one here either, another insert. Uh, Legacy, Darren Collinson, and two inserts, and a rookie, so not all base there. Nice, Kevin Johnson. Collison and Evans. All right, time for our last one. Ooh, we saved ourselves a good you know hour not ripping the uh, the Fleer cards, which maybe I'll do at the end. I honestly still don't know. I'm kind of playing this, kind of winging it right now because I didn't anticipate trying to rip apart cement with my bare hands. All right. Where are those randomly inserted rookies, huh? Where are they at, though? Hmm. So we have... We have a new old pack that presented itself. It is... Oh, yay! <laughs> Our old friend. <laughs> and uh, we have... Who is Joe Johnson. So actually, the, the rookie card... So, I mean, not the rookie cards. The jersey cards aren't that bad. Should be another one right here. Melton Brand. So, I mean, for the most part, all names we know. Now, as far as packs go, oh, we got three optics this time. That's a dub. That's a big dub. So we'll go like this. These guys, I'm sorry, these guys are gonna take a seat. You guys don't get to play today because you've been very bad and try to ruin this break. This one, on the other hand, at least last time we could pull it apart. That being said, I don't love this stuff either. Yeah, see, it's all a little stuck together, but... Um, someone told me that there's a Tim Duncan one you can get in here. That's nice. I don't even know what order this is supposed to be in. All right. This was here on a Star Attractions. Uh, who is this? Antonio Daniels. And I can't even... There you go. 
and see like they're, they're so stuck together they're leaving all this residue it's a shame but uh, I mean Michael Jordan there um, who is this I don't know who this is. Port oh, just Portland, I guess. Yeah, game night. I mean, nothing crazy. You're not gonna get anything too cool in here. Um, mainly just you know a bunch of stuff. It's in these boxes for a reason. Yep. So we'll just put this here, and I think the rest of these are just random face cards. We'll put it here. If they're not, please do let me know. Let's see if we can pull a Carl Anthony Towns from this. We have a TJ McConnell. All right, Mike Conley extra edition. Cameron Artist Payne, no Cameron, not Cameron Artist, Cameron Payne. That's football. Uh, Jonathan Simmons, Miles Turner, and T.J. McConnell. All right, man, this base stack is too big. All right, last chance at one of the top top guys. Here we go. Uh, I wish cards didn't stick together. Okay, they're all base. Grant Hill. Passing Kings, Tyreek Evans. Passing Kings, TJ McConnell, and Passing King. Oh, hey, we got we got Carl Anthony Towns. Asking you shall receive. Not too busy just uh, joking about all those Passing Kings, and we got a big cat. I'll take that. Boban Marjanovic, the rookies. That does not look like a rookie. He looks a good 40 years old there. Boban. Like, what is he? 7'3", 7'2", something like that. Big guy. Fun guy, though. Alright, let's see what we get from here. I know it'll turn back around. There you go. I know you too well, Donruss. Like, too well. We have uh, a bunch of inserts and rookies. Kobe, uh, winner stays. Court Kings, Harden, and Miles Bridges. Herter, Bruce Brown, come on, this is some top guys. Devontae Graham, he's not bad, actually. Uh, Robert Williams, Mari Spellman, and the last one is Marvin Bagley. All right, there you go. Got a good one. No Luca or Trey, but all right. The three to see. Three packs of Optic. This was a pretty solid box in terms of the, the packs we got. And oh, damn it. Luke Kennard, almost Luca. Oh, we have a hollow. Okay. Alfred Payton and... Oh, Clay Thompson, come on. Just give me the give me the guy we want. Luke Kennard. Ah, oh, come on. These are fun because you're, kind of, you're chasing the packs at a chance at getting the card. That's the crazy part. Lock it up. Giannis and then three base cards. And last pack for this break. I'm not even touching those. I mean, they're, they're literally just trouble. All right, last chance. Oh, that's such a troll. LeBron, foreshadow, foreshadow. Dennis Smith Jr. <sighs> All right, Chris Paul and Chandler Hutchinson. So we did get a LeBron. We're just going to recap this stack. We're going to flip through it. I'll pull things as needed. So while we got a LeBron from Optic, it wasn't the hollow LeBron. Still, it's a cool LeBron. So I'll, um, I'm just going to set it all down right here. Dennis Smith Jr. Hollow, Clay Thompson Hollow. So I'll pull our Hollows because those are what we were chasing. We have a Bagley, Devontae Graham. Uh, we got Carl Anthony Towns. Can't sleep on him. And then just a bunch of junk right there. We have our jersey cards. So we actually got some solid players. So those are those are included, and that's what's good. You always get you know that couple bucks and solid guys. Um, we didn't get any scrubs really. Wendell Carter and Sexton. Nice colorful Harden. Wish we pulled, would have pulled a Luga or Trey, but unfortunately they didn't even show up. I sent them an invitation, but they didn't show up. Aaron Gordon to 99, numbered card. Uh, Okafer, it's a nice one, only because I was a fan of his when he was a rookie. Oubre. It's different. These. I guess he just didn't have a picture. Uh, we have Jason Richardson and Amari Stoudemire, a hollow Jalen Brown. So we were pulling hollows left and right, but just wasn't the guy we came here for. Michael Porter Jr. Um, that might have been it for the most part, except for 
are jersey cards and the, these don't even get me started on these that are two jersey cards uh, this guy I don't really know who that is but Ray Allen so here is the highlights of the highlights the actual best cards in my opinion from this break it's, it's I mean of all the vets you know you have it you have a chance of pulling that LeBron hollow with, from these packs I mean the hollows are popping out of these as you can see left and right we pulled f what four hollows so Ray Allen I think my favorite card one hollow is the Carl Anthony Towns oh, Jersey card Jersey card Carl Anthony Towns here there you go another hollow another hollow and LeBron so I think we pulled what three hollows I mean they're definitely here. If you see these, I actually would recommend getting them. Um, worst case scenario, just sell the optic packs because they are good packs. Um, those ho that hollow run and the hollow Luka and the hollow tray, I would encourage you to look up the prices on those. And then that's it. And then after that, next time you see one, you'll go buy it. Unfortunately, the big downside with these is they're thrown around so much you can get some damage on these cards. But um, yeah, my highlight of the break will be this card here. I don't have a lot of Carl Anthony Towns rookies, and it's actually nice to have his rated rookie. There is no optic one, so this is it. Um, but yeah, so long break. I'm gonna be honest. I'm exhausted from that. That was actually like hard, <laughs> but um, yeah, it is cool stuff. These can have good potential. If you ever are curious on whether or not they're worth breaking, always hit me up. I usually try to find and rip some, and uh, we can see. Um, but yeah, overall, that's that's it. <laughs> Tough stuff there. If there is anything to be pulled in there, please do let me know. And um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Let me know if you got anything cool from these. Um, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.